Hey guys, this is Sean from SeanAdge.com and in this video I'm going to tell you a few of the tips and tricks about Microsoft Lumia 640 smartphone. Uh, using this tips and tricks you can increase the productivity on your Microsoft Lumia 640 and you can perform few of the special tasks. So let's start and let me tell you first of all about uh, how to take the screenshot on your Lumia 640. To take the screenshot what you have to do you have to press the power key and the volume up key together like this. And as you can see the screenshot is taken here and if you go to the photo application you will see this is a screenshot we have just taken it's an image so this is how you take the screenshot then Lumia 640 comes with a nice feature of double tap to wake also double tap to off uh, double tap to wake feature is uh, pretty popular and common these days so if your phone is turned off all you have to do is double tap on the screen and the lock screen will come here but a new feature in Lumia 640 is that you can even use the double tap to off so you, you don't have to use the power key anymore so in that feature what you have to do you have to double tap on the navigation key here and the screen will be locked like this so as you can see the screen is locked now if I have to turn it on just double tap on the screen once again okay here is the lock screen if I have to uh, lock the screen just double tap on the navigation bar here and it's turned off so this is one of the very nice and productive feature and uh, every single Lumia device comes with a name which is called Windows Phone so it is pretty confusing if you transfer uh, and use the Bluetooth device for transferring files and all because if you are having multiple devices in then every device will have the same range that's Windows Phone so how to change it so just go to the settings and then go to uh, the system section and then visit the about then tap on it and here you will see the option to edit name just tap on it and then you can do whatever you want for example right now the name here is Sean Heather for my phone as you can see you can change it let's make it just Sean and just tap on this uh, option and you can see the name is changed from Sean as it to Sean so this is how you change the, uh, the name of your Lumia 640 smartphone and uh, <clears throat> the next uh, tips and trick I'm going to tell you that this device comes with the latest Windows Phone 8.1 Lumia the name update 2 and one of the new feature in this version of Windows Phone 8.1 is that now there is a search option in the settings so if you are going to the setting you will see a search option here you just tap on it and uh, all you have to do is just type few characters of a setting for example brightness just type B or, or just B and you can see here uh, all the settings which it starts with B if you have to go to the Bluetooth or brightness just tap uh, R and so here you can do a quick search for all the available settings by using this option then <clears throat> one of the uh, most important thing about any of the smartphone is uh, the battery performance so if you want to see the battery performance on your Lumia 640 what you have to do go to the settings then go to the battery I'm going to use this feature to search battery here is the battery saver as you can see just tap on it and it will show you uh, how much battery is remaining and there is an option of conserve battery life there are two options like uh, when you want this feature to be activated always if you selecting always it will uh, limit some functionality like mobile data and Wi-Fi and all or you can select when battery is less than 20% or something so it, this is up to you and if you want to see that which application is consuming how much battery on your Microsoft Lumia 640 then just tap on the usage and the battery saver and you will see a list of all the applications so here is the list of all the applications as you can see and you can see that mixed radio application has consumed 4.3 and the Lumia camera 2.1 percent and here is the entire list of all the applications and the consumption of battery related to them and if you want to know more about uh, the battery consumption you can see there are two bars in use and background so you can see that uh, in background mixed radio consumed uh, a bit of battery as well so if you want to stop this feature like you do not want uh, any particular application to run in the background so just uh, tap on that particular application and you will see the option to stop 
uh, running in the background you can see here that for a spot at airport I have already selected not allowed so this is not running in the background but if you go to Cortana or news for example you will see the option here allow app to run in the background it's turned on right now so this application is running in the background and consuming battery just so if you want to turn it off just use this uh, slider and it's turned off now and uh, the MSN news application will not run in the background so this is how you can save a bit of battery on your Lumia 640 and then the next thing is uh, uh, how to do uh, how to change the theme of your Microsoft Lumia 640 starter screen so just go to the setting once again and here you will find under personalization start plus theme so right now it's selected cyan you can whether uh, change the background from dark to light then if I'm selecting light the background will be white as you can see here and then you can change the color as well right now uh, my theme is cyan so if I'm selecting red now I can go back and you can see everything is red now like this and even in the list of applications uh, the red color is highlighted as you can see here and uh, how to change the wallpaper here if you want to change the ball wallpaper just uh, go to the settings go to the same place that start plus theme and here you will see the option to choose photo so just tap on it select the picture here I'm going to select uh, from the background folder you can select any of the folder from uh, camera application or from the uh, background folder and let me select uh, this one you can once again here set uh, which part of the feature you want on the starter screen and it's selected now now let's go back here and you will see uh, the background is changed and the picture I have selected is appearing in the background right now if you want to remove this or change it once again you can just go to the same place start plus theme and you can select remove or choose photo and select another photo it's up to you so right now I'm just removing it and once again here it is my phone back at its glory then uh, you can see here that I have created a folder for uh, all of the games I'm having on my device and also for the benchmarking application here as you can see so how to do this how to create a folder uh, on the starter screen it's pretty easy actually all you have to do is just drag and drop an application on another and group them together for example here's the Skype application here's the Lumia camera if I want to create a folder with these two applications all I have to do just tap and hold any of the application drag and drop on another like this and you can see a folder is created right here in front of you if you tap on the name folder you can even name it uh, for example social or whatever let's make it social just uh, now just go back and here is the folder called social with Skype and Lumia camera if you want to delete uh, uh, a folder what you have to do you have to remove each of the uh, application uh, inside the folder individually and after that the folder will be deleted by itself so this is how you create a folder and uh, uh, on your Microsoft Lumia 640 smartphone and as you can see there is just one application in the folder and if I'm moving it outside you can see the folder is no more here it just got deleted so this is how you create a folder and delete a folder on your Lumia 640 smartphone and the next uh, feature I'm going to tell you about your Lumia 640 is that how to close the task running in the background so here it is if I'm opening for example settings I'm going to the settings here and I'm not closing it properly and just tapping on the starter screen and going back on the starter screen then I am opening the Lumia camera here and then once again I'm going back so all these applications are running in the background and consuming your battery right now because they are not closed properly so how to close them what you have to do just tap and hold on the uh, back navigation key here like this and all of the application running in the background they will appear on the screen so as uh, I just uh, showed you that uh, I didn't close the setting and the camera application they are 
running the background so close them what you have to do either just tap on this X or just slide them down like this and all the running application in the background are closed now then uh, if you go to the setting once again you will find a nice feature of data sense here I'll just type here this is a very nice feature as you can see here where you can restrict the use of mobile data on your device so what you have to do now it's there is no limit is specified just tap on the set limit you can select prepaid monthly or unlimited whatever limit you are using and then you can also you're having the option restrict background data users restrict background data when you're roaming and then browse browser data savings like uh, in which format you want your browser to uh, open the load the page like in standard high or automatic let, let them decide how to do this so using this you can save your mobile data you can save your bill telephone bill as well so this is also a very nice feature on your Lumia 640 then uh, on your Lumia 640 if you go to the top here you will find the action center which provides you the latest notification and here are the uh, quick setting buttons and uh, for example right now I'm using the Wi-Fi Bluetooth mobile data and location on my action center but if you want you can change it for example if you don't use Wi-Fi at your home or your mobile data or you just don't use Bluetooth so if you want to make any changes in this what you have to do is go to the settings and there you will find action center here you can see notification plus actions just go to here and here you will see the options which I'm having right now so for example you want to remove the mobile data just tap on it select what you want instead of mobile data right now mobile data is selected I'm selecting the brightness here and you can see the brightness is appearing instead of uh, mobile data if you go to the action center right now you can see here is the brightness instead of uh, the previously selected mobile data so this is how you can customize your action center also there is a list of all the applications for which uh, the notification is appearing on the action center so you can even uh, edit them if you do not want to receive a notification uh, from a particular application you can just go there and turn them off like showing action center just turn them off or if you are turning them on you can select which type of notification you want like show banner alerts whether you want the notification sound or not and uh, rest of like vibration and also here is how you can customize your action center on your Lumia 640 so another thing which I'm going to tell you is about the glance screen Lumia 640 is having a nice feature which is called glance screen this is what is glance screen when your phone is locked you will see the time and notification uh, a summary of notification that um, what is waiting for you in the action center so you can even customize it, this feature what we have to do go to the settings go to glance screen here and then you will get the option that with how frequent you want glance screen to appear on your lock screen and uh, uh, always show glance screen when charging or not what you want there is night mode for different colors if you are using uh, Lumia 640 you can even customize the color of glance screen if you're using at night whether you want red green blue or just you want to hide the glance screen at all well uh, when you are sleeping so this is how you can customize the glance screen and uh, you can even customize your navigation keys here so if you go to the navigation here is the option navigation bar just go here and you will get a lot of application that whether you want always dark or you want to match the background or you want to match the accent color so right now it's always dark if I'm selecting the accent color it will be red as you can see it just turned to red or you can uh, select the option auto hide or show the navigation bar if you are selecting this you will have to uh, do this manually your navigation bar you will have to do like this you can see now a notification is appearing so this is kind of annoying so it's better to uh, use the navigation bar always turn on and then here is the uh, double tap to lock the screen which I have shown already it's on so if I 
just double tap on this navigation bar my Lumia 640 will be locked so this is a collection of all the tips and tricks about Lumia 640 so thanks for watching the video friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos tips and tricks and hands-on reviews like this have a nice day